As we all know, uh, the construction that happened within Eglinton and Young have been so disruptive for most businesses that are close to the area. That's a real big problem when we're talking about small businesses that depend on foot traffic. And that's why getting the construction mitigation grant was extremely important for us to come back from that and not only come back and survive, but also thrive. Honestly, it was one of the best things that we were able to get from the city, which was grants to support the businesses while supporting the construction of new transit. Part of what we did was to look at things and think about what we could do to bring more life into the BIA. And we did that through our rebranding. Well, the grant um, allowed us to create amazing things for uh, my BIA, such as uh, rebranding. creating all the great events for the area. And uh, allowed us to create all the merch too, so people can take a little bit of the My BIA home. I am a restaurant owner in the neighborhood. I'm also a past chair of this board. As well, I live in the neighborhood. So the rebranding has allowed us to put banners to make it thrive and make it just look so much more visible that actually this is a destination, is a place to go to. The word my just alone has made people come together. When someone drives into Midtown Young, they go, my BIA, wow, that's cool. I see a long-term success for this neighborhood stemming from the acts of the BIA. The city has gone out of its way through this program to assist the neighborhood in not only surviving, but thriving. The Midtown Young BIA is a very small BIA. We don't have a lot of businesses. And because of that, our annual budget is quite small. So we wouldn't be able to do what we did for this project, the rebranding project, without the grant. The construction mitigation grant was able to, to provide us with the ability to create a new BIA.